Take a look at these three men. Can you guess what they have in common? None of them actually exist. Believe it or not, they were created by artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence. First real artificial intelligence. It's a scary thought that AI can create such realistic images. AI like ChatGPT, Dreamscape, and Midjourney can create photorealistic images, including near-perfect replicas of humans. Should we be scared? Everyone posts pics on social media, but how do we tell the difference between what's real and what's not? So many of us rely on images on social media to help with first impressions. But is that guy you're chatting with really who he appears to be? Artificial intelligence is going to kill us all. Why haven't the creators of artificial intelligence taken heed from movies? Is that old cliche, does art actually imitate life? Are we on the same path as humanity in the Terminator movies? Should we hide away in our doomsday bunker and stockpile on food and porn magazines? Are we living in the end of times? Let's all just calm down for a second. Surely we can tell the difference between what's real and what's not. Take a look at these male models. Can you tell which one is a real person? Did you guess correctly? Do you want to try again? Did you get it this time? How can you tell the difference? Let's zoom in. Take a closer look at the hands. No matter how advanced AI appears to be, it struggles with recreating human hands and feet. Hands and feet are usually not proportional to the body if you look close enough. Either the digits are too long, crooked or even too many. Or the model has two left feet. So if AI is so advanced and might take over the world to enslave humanity, why does it struggle with creating hands and feet? Let's do a simple test with an apple. All these men have nightmarishly deformed hands, but why? Look at this hand. The shapes are bizarre, but the AI has done a great job showing the light and texture here. Remember, the AI knows how things look, but not how they work. So these patterns in pixels are easy to understand. It never learned, however, that fingers don't really bend like this. So it is just trying to guess where hand-like pixels should be without knowing how hands work. So AI struggles with hands because it doesn't understand how hands work. Let's see how far we can push AI's understanding of human interaction. Will it be able to generate images of intimacy? So, does these horrifying images of gay men kissing mean that AI is homophobic? Let's see how AI fares with our straight counterparts showing intimacy. So, AI can imitate humans to an extent, but when it comes down to more intricate dynamics of our anatomy, or what it means to be human, it struggles. In our pursuit to play God, we've designed AI to strive to improve itself. It's constantly learning from what we present to it, closing the ever-shrinking gap between human consciousness and AI. You even get apps where you can customize your chatbot to look and act however you want them to be, creating the perfect companion. What do you think about AI? Will it take over the world? Or is it just the latest craze like Pokemon Go which will eventually fade away? Let us know in the comments section. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to click like and subscribe. Also, check out some of the other videos on this channel.